Mental health is just as important as physical health, so Children's Wisconsin is starting a new program to promote healthy minds. Joining me now is Katie Horrigan to talk about the upcoming mission Healthy Kids Healthy Schools Challenge. Katie, good afternoon. Thanks so much for being with us. Can you just start us off by telling us about this program and why focusing on healthy minds is so important right now? Absolutely. Well, thanks for having me. Uh, Children's and Coles have been partnering for many years to keep kids healthy, focusing on keeping kids fit, um, eating the right foods, and just feeling good. And we've also had the opportunity to partner with schools throughout um, throughout the state, and we're excited to kick off some new opportunities for schools focusing on healthy minds. And, you know, we hear the term healthy minds. Can you talk about what factors contribute to that? Yeah, so many factors contribute. I have, I have girls who are 10 and 13, and we have to think about this all the time. So um, talking about stress and anxiety, getting enough sleep, trying to reduce screen time, and integrating all of this into our daily conversations just to make sure that this is normal and that we're addressing it as it comes up. And how, how can schools and families get involved in this, in this challenge that you guys have? Yeah, starting March 1st, schools throughout the state, whether they're in person or virtual, will be able to sign up and pick a project that will focus on furthering support for emotional health of their students. And those who are able to uh, participate and give us the information by April 30th will be entered into a drawing for one of 20 uh, $1,000 awards to be able to further this work. And we're doing this work in collaboration with the Department of Public Instruction. And anyone looking for info can go to missionhealthykids.org. Awesome. Katie, I know obviously uh, some of the things you talked about, you know, reducing screen time, uh, those types of tips to help promote those healthy minds. Uh, you know, sometimes for some parents, it can be easier said than done. So as parents uh, continue on this, what's your word of advice or your encouragement to them? Just keep going and listening to your kids. I mean, the best way to understand how our kids are thinking and feeling is to really engage with them and integrate um, different tips and tricks throughout uh, the day. And through our Mission Healthy Kids program, we have a variety of resources from videos to activities that families can be participating in together with their kids. All right, great to hear. Katie, thanks so much for being with us this afternoon. Absolutely, thanks for having me.